Have you ever had buckwheat pancakes? Mmm, they're my favorite and they're made from the whole grain kasha. Welcome to Healthy Cooking with Val. Hi, I'm Chef Valerie Wilson. Well, this is kasha. It is the signature whole grain of the winter time. Now, what is a whole grain? A whole grain is your complex carbohydrate food. It's what gives your body energy. All of our ancient ancestors had a diet based around whole grains. In fact, kasha has been eaten for over 5,000 years and it comes to us from Siberia and Russia where it's very, very cold. So when you eat kasha, it helps to impart heat into your body. Kasha, or what some people refer to as buckwheat, is very medicinal for you. It helps to stabilize your blood sugar and it contains the bioflavonoid rutin, which is excellent to feed and nurture your capillaries and your blood vessels. And it also helps to improve circulation to your hands and your feet. Contains 100% more calcium than other whole grains. Contains almost the entire range of B vitamins. And you know how important that is because your body gets deplete of B vitamins when you're stressed out. So now that I've told you all about the great health benefits of kasha, you're wondering, well, how do I cook it? What do I do with it? Well, because it's a whole grain, you're going to want to pot boil it, which is very simple. You take one cup of kasha and two cups of water, put it in a pot, and bring it to a boil. And then you reduce it to the lowest possible temperature, and it takes approximately 35-40 minutes to cook. You will know kasha is done because all the water will have been absorbed. It has a nice, earthy, nutty, sweet flavor to it. It cooks up nice and creamy, so it makes great casseroles. I've created this delicious, warming, spicy kasha casserole right here. I actually cook the whole grain kasha with some vegetables. I have some butternut squash, some turnip, and carrot in there. And then once it was cooked, I seasoned it with nice warming spices, curry, turmeric, paprika, and I added some fresh parsley and then baked it in the oven. It comes out of the oven and it smells so delicious with those spices. And then when you eat it, it just satisfies your taste buds and it imparts all this warmth into your body, which we really need right now because it's very cold outside. Now when you go to the health food store, you will find kasha in the bulk section. I have a fantastic recipe in my cookbook for buckwheat burgers along with some other recipes featuring the whole grain kasha. My cookbook, Perceptions in Healthy Cooking, you can purchase on my website at macroval.com. And don't forget to like my Facebook page, Macroval Food. Remember, your journey to eating healthy begins with one small step. Let's make that small step the whole grain kasha. Mmm.